Greetings. We have another interesting question from signals and systems asked in gate examination. You see, now uh, we have a system as follows. You see, if x of n, this quantity is input, if x of n is bounded by a finite integer, this block b, it can be shown that y of n, y of n is output, it can be shown that y of n is bounded by a finite number, say block c. Now express C in terms of B and N sub 0. It's very simple. There is no big deal in this. So you, you, we are uh, given a system. This is our system. Yeah. So the system is establishing a link between uh, input and output. And we have limits. Okay. We have the summation running from limit N minus N naught to N plus N naught. So in this scenario, he also gave us x of n is bounded. Okay, see x of n is bounded by a finite integer b. What is the meaning of this? So I take its absoluteness. So x of n is bounded. So this b itself is finite. Okay, so as b itself is finite given like this. So x of n for all n. Okay, for all n x of n is bounded by a finite integer this block b now uh, it can be shown that y of n is bounded by a finite number c again that means so my system is this so let me take let if i if i apply absoluteness on the old system so now this equality becomes inequality okay so this is k is running from n minus n naught to n plus n naught and this quantity is x of k so absoluteness applied over input again all right now already we have this whether it is x of n or x of k x of l doesn't matter with the indices the quantity must be b so therefore y of n y of n absoluteness we have summation k is running from n minus n sub 0 to n plus n sub 0 x of k or x of n absoluteness is p so i'll take p all right so anyways now now what we have end of the day we can put things down like this so i can bring this see we don't have any k associated with this b so i can bring this uh, b outside yeah because the limits are running for k not for anything this b this b is uh, it's self a constant a finite value so i can bring it out so now you have k is equal to n minus n naught to n plus n naught this is one all right so just give me two more seconds meanwhile i'll get my red sketch thank you so this is what you have for now okay now some of us may ponder uh, how to tackle this this is very simple there's no big deal in that you know what is this see whenever you have like this for example anything if not infinity if not see for example you have k is equal to something like uh, some n1 and this is some n2 say you have one now you know what to do upper limit you take upper limit upper limit minus lower limit okay upper limit minus lower limit plus one plus this one yeah it, this technique is uh, valid uh, whenever we have one here okay other than one it is uh, if any other quantity we have other than one this may not hold true always so upper limit minus lower limit plus this one so what we have now n2 minus n1 plus one this is the answer for this one right similarly you can check it out see y of n absoluteness y of n is bounded by a finite number c so this absoluteness is bounded by a finite number c okay 
so c less than or equal to i have b here i have b this b is as it is now this quantity this uh, this quantity i'll take it as a multiple now see upper limit upper limit minus lower limits okay so n plus n naught is my upper limit minus lower limit n minus n naught okay plus 1 simple technique so n n is ruled out so n naught plus this so 2 n naught plus 1 so finally we have 2 n sub 0 plus 1 that's it this is simple right so see in examination they will check your analytical skills there is no big deal in this question just you should know this uh, mere fundamentals you can tackle this kind of questions that easily okay so that's it so c less than or equal to uh, b times 2 and 0 plus 1 okay so thank you thank you thank you for your patience so we are done for today so we have uh, this uh, gate uh, gate series on signals and systems, uh, uh, digital signal processing, digital communications, analog communications, electronic divisions, uh, devices, and analog electronic circuits. We have on circuit theory control systems, okay, and also on uh, engineering mathematics, uh, yeah, electromagnetic theory. It's very important, electromagnetic theory, physics of semiconductors whatever uh, digital logic design or switching theory logic design whatever so so we have series of uh, those lectures we will discuss uh, previous year problems and standard textbook unsolved questions in this channel so please do watch things until end uh, because there are some important points in the middle so we should not miss those important points please do watch until end and please do subscribe and please share your thoughts in the comment section below okay so we can uh, we have to maintain full duplex communication okay so please do share your thoughts in the comment section if you want any other thing if, if you want uh, if you want uh, if you want me to make some other videos on uh, latest concepts okay you're most welcome we can go ahead with that so please do watch things and Please do subscribe. Thank you.